This is video taken by Randy Peeler of Brighton with eight people inside a 2015 Ford Explorer. This is ridiculous. It happens randomly. It's horrible. I, every time I got into the vehicle, I was scared. It went black. The electronic system going haywire, warning the brake system is out of whack. There's low tire pressure, all-wheel drive is turned off, the stability control system is off, and the front airbag is malfunctioning. These are the warnings that come out of nowhere, all by themselves, it seems. Four minutes of this on the highway in that construction zone mess on I-96 and US-23. Now the heat's off now. Randy's wife, Virginia, is in the passenger seat. I didn't know if the brakes were going to go, if the steering was going to go, and... Um, I had kids in the car that started screaming because they knew something was wrong with the car, so that didn't help. That wasn't the first time the Peter family's Ford Explorer decided to lose control of the majority of its electronic system. In fact, it wasn't the second. It was the third time in just one month, and it keeps happening. Six times now. Took it into the Ford Brighton dealership. Stability control problems, which is what I have. These phone calls to the service department at Brighton Ford are almost a daily occurrence. The Peeler's SUV has been in and out of Ford service department 34 out of 60 days. Mechanics and engineers unable to pinpoint the problem. Could be three or four modules that control all of the car's electronics. It could be a network issue, in which case the entire car is at risk. Trying to identify what the problem was and they couldn't isolate it. So it got to the point where they just said, you need to come pick up your vehicle. <laughs> this is a highly unusual incident that's going on. It might be rare, says automotive analyst John McElroy, but when these problems do arise with electronics in these cars, they can be complicated to diagnose. Look, there's no question whatsoever that the electronics in the car are the most complicated part of the vehicle. In fact, electronics cause more warranty issues than anything else that's going on in the car. Simply put, they don't know what's going on, but it keeps going on. The latest on October 12th, when Virginia Peeler pulled through this car wash. So after that latest debacle with the Ford Explorer in the car wash, the Peelers brought the SUV back here to Brighton Ford. They're not mad at the dealer for not being able to figure out what's wrong. They're concerned that they can figure out what's wrong. Concerned for their safety and for the safety of others. The Peelers are not alone. A simple Google search turns up multiple complaints of electrical malfunctions in these Ford SUVs. They've even run into people locally. It had the same advanced track terrain management fault systems, and it was an intermittent problem. They couldn't identify what to do. And not only did her engine go out, her brakes went out, and her power steering went out. And she ended up plowing over some mailboxes. And she was lucky it wasn't a person there. We've spoken to Ford Motor Company. A spokesperson says they wouldn't have returned the car if they didn't believe it was safe to drive. Is there a way to turn it down? But they have told the peelers they're working on it. Tom Jordan, CBS, Detroit.